Welcome back. So we have a new subscription box to review. So jampacks.net, I've seen a few of them ripped previously on YouTube. Um, newer company, seem to be putting out a decent product and it's right around the same price point as all the other subscription boxes in that 50 to $60 range. So I feared I'd give them a shot. Um, now the interesting thing with this product is that they guarantee a Hall of Fame auto in every box. Now I'm not expecting huge names. It's, you know, you're sending out a lot of Jim Rice and Don Sutton autos, but it's still a guaranteed Hall of Fame auto. And they give you some uh, bonus players. They give you an entire pack of top loaders entire pack of sleeves and the packs and peanuts don't forget peanuts so before I kind of go into everything so eight hobby packs from 2018-19 along with 12 singles in a team bag um 100 card sleeves, 25 top loaders, and a custom jam pack, which is in gold, which contains one star rookie card and one Hall of Fame, Hall of Famer certified autograph. And then the packs are 18 Optic, 18 Archives, 18 Allen Ginter, 19 Archives, 19 Allen Ginter, 19 Series 2, 19 Gypsy Queen, and 19 Donruss. So, for a comparable price, you're not getting the same quality packs, to be completely honest with you, as the other um, subscription boxes, but the bonuses could easily make up for that. So, we're going to go to packs first. There should be eight packs in here, which there are. So let's figure out what kind of order I want to do these in. So Don Russ is going to lead it off. I'm pretty darn sure of that. All right, I think that's a good order. I'll leave the Series 2 tops for the last. All right, starting off with 19 Donruss. Starting off with a Matt Boyd. Okay. Matt Carpenter. Caleb Ferguson to 99. A spacer. Verlander, Blake Snell, Corey Kluber, Loisiga, or however you say it, and a Justin Turner. All right. So one pack in, we have a random rookie to number number to ninety nine. All right. So nineteen Gypsy Queen. Hit odds are one in twelve. Eduardo Escobar, Victor Robles, Jose Martinez, Lopez, Jeffries, Freddie Freeman switched up uh, nameplate, so it has the face instead of the Gypsy Queen, the GQ. All right, so there's been a little bit of something in every pack so far. All right, so 19 archives. Nineteen archives, hit odds one and twelve. Smoke, Myers, Urena, Gallo, Duplantier, Yelich, Kyle Tucker, put him aside, and Johnny Mize. All right, eighteen archives, one and twelve. Peta, 
hombre. You're gonna blow in there. Kofax, that's a hit for me. Satchel Page, James McCann, Ender Enciarte Blue, which is numbered to 25. Lucas Sims and Zach Grinky. Again, we're pulling a teeny bit out of each pack, but nothing significant. So 19, Allen and Ginter. Hit odds are 1 and 8. Rizzo, Altuve, regular mini, Rizzuto, Plain, Bueller, and Mattingly, 18 Ginter, good odds, 1 and 8. Got the shiny. It's from a hot box. Barreto, Blackman, Yelich, McGuire, Gardner, Castellanos, a Bell, and G back, and a Tom Seaver. So unfortunately, we didn't hit any of the really good rookies because they would have been really nice with the hot box. All right, so Optic from 18. Hit odds 1 in 10. Kershaw, Belly, Tavares, and Bader. So not much in there. All right, so 19 Series 2. This is 124 for a hit, but really we're just looking for the key rookies. Or a short print of oh, Vladdy. Jake Cave, White Sox. Junior. Not getting a short print. And nothing in there. Alright. So, wasn't the best of luck with packs. Did get some numbered stuff. But let's see what the 12 singles team bag. Let's see how good the singles are. Starting off with the Wade Boggs, Bryce Harper, Senzel Rookie, Machado, Molina from Chrome, DeGrom, Sale, Beltre, Moncada Rookie, Contreras, Garrett Cole, and Blackman. So it's at least respectable in the singles. It's nothing great, but respectable. All right, so in here, this is the gold pack. One star rookie and one Hall of Famer. Certified auto. So a little sneak peek. There's a thick one in there. All right. Is there some way you can do this here? I don't want to ruin the surprise of the auto. Because I want to be surprised right along with you. Hopefully it's a good one. Hopefully it's a PC one. All right, so starting off, the star rookie is a Manny Machado. Which is really nice. This is the mini version, which is a lot harder. So there's actually some decent value into these minis. So I give him credit. That's a decent one. And then the auto... Hall of Fame auto of, from Flawless, wow. Juan Marshall, the 25. That's a pretty nice auto right there. Oh. So it's not, you know, it's not one of the base ones. This is actually a pretty decent auto, Hall of Fame auto. And I don't think I had an, a Marshall. So, the packs themselves you know, are not great. It's not the greatest selection of packs. 
I don't think there's any arguing with that um, when you compare to other subscription boxes. Um, the, the nice thing is you do get a full pack of um, sleeves and a full pack of top loaders. Let's just say three bucks there. I'm trying to be conservative here. So three bucks. Let's just say it's a five dollar Machado rookie. I don't think it is. Um, well, you know what? Let's just round it up to ten. Um, it's probably a twenty dollar auto, so it's thirty total. Um, these are probably I've seen of a quarter piece. So one, two, three. Uh, and we're approximately 30 bucks there. All right, and then the PAX Optic. Okay, probably three archives. Let's say 250, 250. Is that for Series 2? 19 Series 2, you're probably looking at. I've seen all these as low as 250 a pack. Um, so you're looking at 10, 20, 30 bucks there. So at the very, very least, being hugely conservative, um, you're looking at 50, 60 bucks, uh, in value. So they're right in line with the value where it should be. And I'm quite pleased with that. Um, uh, it was a really nice auto. You know, it wasn't the incredibly common ones. Even though Marischal is a little bit more common this year, it's still a very nice auto to get out of, of uh, um, as a bonus. Um, so, overall, I may consider getting another one next month. Um, and I should note, note at the bottom of this letter is... Next month will be free pack February. Every box ordered will receive a free pack of cards. Don't know what pack it'll be, but free pack is a free pack. That's an extra chance. So, I think this is a pretty good one. I think it's worth giving it a shot. Um, I think it's worth kind of seeing what happens next month. Um, by ordering another box and kind of going from there. I want to kind of see what the the bonus hits, whether they're consistent in putting good bonus hits in there. Um, packs, again, they can't really go down from here unless they start putting like opening day in um, or big league. But there's at least, you know, lower to mid-range packs in here. Um, nice bonus pack, nice auto and rookie pack. Um, I thought it was a pretty good deal overall. So we'll give it another shot next month and we'll continue our evaluation of this product. So that gives us three subscription boxes now on current rotation. Um, the jam packs dot uh, net. This is a new school jam pack, by, by the way. Um, the rookie rated box, and finally, the definitely um, not to be forgotten is the rookie card explosion box. Um, so two certain ones to continue. This one may or may not, depending on how things progress over the next month, maybe two. But definitely worth taking a look. Uh, hope you enjoyed the evaluation, and until next time, collect what you enjoy, enjoy what you collect, and don't let anybody, especially the market or a YouTuber, dictate that to you. And most importantly, have fun. And the best way to have fun in this hobby is to be active in the community. So find your way of being active and participating. Whether it's making videos, watching and commenting, going to live streams, group chats, 
Go to your LCS local card show. I'm talking about the hobby of family and friends. You have to be active in the community to truly enjoy what it has to offer. So I encourage you, I implore you to find your way of contributing to the community, whatever way that may be, as long as you're active in the community, because the knowledge you'll gain, the friends you'll make, and the cards you'll be able to see is just a fantastic experience. So thank you for joining me. Hope to see you again. Have a good one, and bye for now.